Welcome to Gordian. Now, Gordian was famous for its knot. And the oracle one day prophesied, whosoever shall untie the knot shall conquer the entire world. Many people came from far and wide, but no one could untie it. Until one day, the mighty Alexander arrived. Alexander, descended from the mighty god Apollo. Apollo enlightened Alexander and showed him how to untie the knot. Return to Rome to establish order. He declares that the innocent have no reason to fear, but that those guilty of crimes against him shall be most severely punished. The men whose names are written on these lists are declared outlaws. They have no rights as citizens henceforth. They may be killed on sight. Anyone who takes it upon himself to kill any of these men will be considered a friend of the state and shall be rewarded with the property and possessions these outlaws leave behind. It's the greatest crime in Roman law. Where's my wife? At her father's. Grandmother, the soldiers are coming. Julia, stay with her. Sulla is taking the city with his army. He's made lists. Hundreds of people are on them. Are you? No, my wife's father is. Julia, stay in the house. Don't go. Father, where are you going? To get your mother. <laughs> running away. Might as well die right here. Please go. She's right, Sinner. You must leave now. Sinner! Run! 
send us to escape. Give me your name. It's Caesar, from the house of Julie. Arrest him. Julius Caesar? Yes. This way. Caesar. Ah. Nephew to Maria. You have unfortunate ancestry. If you think it's unfortunate to be descended from the gods. <laughs> now, which god was that? The Julians are descended from Aeneas, who was... The son of Venus. Ah, yes, 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 yes. I recall Marius making such a claim. There are many people these days who claim to be descended from gods. Well, we have a crest which proves it. I believe you could have them fashioned in the marketplace for a couple of dinars. Why did you ask to see me? Your mother. She came to see me. Did she? ask you to spare my life and what you agreed. Well, I promised that I would consider it. And I'm supposed to be grateful to you? No. She is. We're old friends. You've killed a lot of old friends. Oh, yes. True. True, true. Old friends in the day become fresh enemies at night. What do you want in exchange for my life? Why do you think I want anything in exchange? And like you don't give things away for free. I'm not a man without compassion. I will help you if I can. First, you must understand the gravity of a crime. Senna was my greatest enemy, and you helped him to escape. Did he? <laughs> of course not. He did escape my soldiers, only to be killed by one of his servants. My wife. She's well. I leave women to their health. And since you are only the son of sinner by marriage, I intend to leave you to yours. If. If you divorce your wife. Well? No. I refuse. You refuse to divorce your wife, even though it may cost you your life. My wife is my teacher. She's cleverer than I am. She's more honest than I am. She's a more compelling argument than I am, or you are, or your office is. I won't divorce her. <laughs> 